My name is Sheena Phillip. And my name is Elaine Menard. And we're going to present our project of a radio direction finding system using the technique of phase interferometry. So, what is phase interferometry? Phase interferometry is a phase-based method that is based on the principle that a signal from the same source will arrive at one antenna with a phase different to another antenna. A right angle triangle can be formed from the emitter to the two antennas and using trigonometry an expression can be derived to calculate the angle of arrival. The system is composed of an antenna array, a USRP and a Python script. Two monopole antennas are designed which can receive frequencies in the range of 80 to 100 MHz. These are placed on a ground plane with the spacing of lambda over 4 to reduce ambiguities. The signals picked up by the antennas are transferred to the USRP into GNU radio. The biggest problem is extracting the desired signal from noise and interference. The FFT is used to split the signal into its different frequency components. Once this is done, the frequency of interest is isolated and the phase information extracted. The phase difference is then calculated and exported to a .dat file. The Python script imports the information from the .dat file into a readable format. It then performs the necessary calculation to determine the angle of arrival and removes outliers to improve accuracy. The final result is displayed on a screen. Set up, I'm going to be demonstrating how it works. We are going to be picking up high top at an angle of 45 degrees. Okay, we're going to be running our system now. So you can hear that high fault stereo is being picked up and you can see those are the two signals that we're receiving from our antenna. Now that we have collected our data, we are going to run our Python script to get the angle of arrival. As you can see, we get the angle to be 48.2368 degrees, which is about 3 degrees off from what we expected. Testing is performed on the system in three different locations, two of which are in an open field and one in a residential area. Two radio stations are retrieved and the average of five trials is taken. The deviation from the true angle and the average of the three deviations are displayed in the graph as shown. The overall system has an average deviation of 12.4 degrees and an error of 6.83%. However, it is noted that by looking at just the inner range, the deviation is 6 degrees with a 5% error, which multiplies by a factor of approximately 4 to the outer range. This is because there is a non-linear relationship between the electrical and mechanical angle. It is also noted that there is an element of randomness to the deviations due to the individual path a signal travels due to reflections and multipath. In conclusion, we have successfully created a radio direction finding system using phase interferometry. Thanks for watching our video.